Hello all and welcome to episode 3 of the randomized Nuzlocke Pokemon Red version with me, Mr. Houndoomer. If you watched episode 2, you know that I got the badge in the last episode. If not, I'm sorry I spoiled that. Please go back and watch the first and second episode if you missed any of them. If not, watch the second one. Anyways... We are on our way to Mount Moon with a level 11 Fong. Let's see, we'll do a quick team recap at the beginning. Get my timer started there. That would kind of be important. Throat is a little scratchy. Recording these videos is taking a bigger toll than I had realized originally on my voice but I feel like it's something I will get used to and it will not stop from rec me from recording and uploading let's see we have a level 10 gas aka wheezing with mirror move disable and thunder punch we have stew at level 11 the sand shrew with fire blast horn attack and tackle we also have Fong, love that name, level 11, Body Slam, Skull Bash, Stun Spore, and Razor Leaf, and our starter in the series, Noddle the Tangela, with Confusion and Tri-Attack, the highest level Pokemon with the least amount of moves. To be fair, Stu would only have two, but I taught it the TM for I believe it was horn attack I got that from beating Brock so that's a thing pretty sure either way if not let me know in the comments you know what to do So now going to battle through the trainers on the way to Mount Moon and going to try not to die. Hoping this will be a good successful series and not a short lived leaving me crying in the corner curled up in a ball series. Alright gas here we go. Trainer number two. Hi there I like shorts they're comfy and easy to wear. Well I don't like shorts because they don't like me. I like pants. And you do not look like a swimmer. That is a full on Rhyhorn. What did the Rhyhorns have before? I mean, Thunder Punch isn't gonna do anything. Gonna use Fong. I feel like you have a fire move. Jump Kick. Oh, that is not good for Fong! Fong! Razor Leaf! Take out that Rhyhorn! Yes! That is the way to do it. That is how we do it. Oh, no, it's got another one. It's an Onyx. This is what Brock was supposed to have. But he didn't. He did not. And why am I still trying to use moves whenever I know you can't attack? Fong to the rescue again! Please don't have anything. Okay, okay, mirror move. That's. Oh, we do not want to deal with that because if Razor Leaf doesn't kill, then it would possibly kill Fong. But Onyx has weak special attack, so well, weak special in this. Yes, never mind. Doesn't matter. Does not matter because. Onyx is down and Gas is level 11. And Fong is level 12. Alright. I defeated that swimmer. I'll teach you to swim on land. You crazy kid in your shorts. Did I battle her? I feel like I didn't. I feel like I'm going to regret taking her on, but I'm going to go for it. 
No, I'm not, because I already beat her. Awesome. So I do not have to deal with that. Is there a trainer down here? There's not. Is there an item down here? No. Okay. I feel like there should be an item in that shrub. Like, it, ju it just makes sense in my mind. There should be an item in that shrub. And yes, I'm pretty sure that's a shrub. Pretty sure all of these are shrubs. However, those weird little post blocky thingies, I do not know what those are. If you know what those are, please let me know. That would be great. What does this sign say? We got health tips. Trainer tips. All Pokemon that takes part in battle, however short, earns XP. Yes. Yes, I, I know this. And yet I read the sign. I guess that's on me. Alright. Next trainer. Ah. Nuts. I gave you an intriguing look. I don't think my face changes. I'm pretty sure it's the same expression the entire length of the game. Whether I beat the champion or have crushing defeat, it pretty much stays the same. And we are going to fire blast this Weedle that is faster and is going to use solar beam unless this kills. Wow, that is pretty scary actually. All right, and next we have a shelter. I know Fire Blast is not super effective, but it would do some damage, but we are going to go for Horn Attack, and that is not good. Psychic is, oh, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no, that would have been bad. Bomb to the rescue! Oh, and you're gonna keep going with Psychic, huh? Why doesn't my Cloister know Psychic? It used to be a Shelter, maybe. I mean, we're evolutions are randomized, so... Maybe it didn't used to be a Shelter. Maybe it used to be a Magikarp. Maybe it was a Bellsprout. Maybe it was a Pidgey. I will never know. Unless I evolve something that turns into Fong. No! You're the one talking about my look. Give me attitude about my look. Whenever I have the same face the entire time. I mean, look at those beady little eyes. Look at those eyes. What? What are you looking at? Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, what? It... Oh, okay, I'm dealing with some emotional stuff going on right now. My looks have been insulted. And you have a polywag. That little hypnotic circle on his little belly. Bong to the rescue! Ah, it's got fire punch. We get, we get. Tell you what, this this cloister has really been a lot better addition to the team than I thought it was gonna be. I thought with the limited move set, it wouldn't be all that helpful, but it has been like the MVP of the team so far. I mean, I know Noddle's at level... I think Noddle's at level 14. Yes, Noddle's at 14. And was our starter. But, I mean, whenever things start getting a little hairy, who comes out but Fong? And Fong saves the day. Except this time. This one was Noddle. Good job, Noddle. Stew to level 12. Ooh, a Hitmonlee. I'm going to go ahead and stay out and get these points for Noddle. Noodle, Noddle, Noddle, Noodle. Alright. What we got now? A Golem. Bought a Golem earlier. What did it have? I think. I may be mixing up my playthroughs here. In one of these, it may be this one, it may not. If not, I apologize, but there was a golem with quick attack and that was seriously messed up. 
I wanted that golem. Raising your defense isn't going to help against a special move. Golem. What is the matter with you? Do you not know how this game works? I destroy... Oh, not a level 15! Woo! Destroy the invisible golem. That will teach you... What are you, an ace trainer? Yeah. Now I need to go back to the Pokemon Center and talk to Nurse Joy so she will make me feel better about myself. And get a drink of water because my throat is really, really starting to bother me. Looks like I can figure out how to get in here. There we go. Thank you, Nurse Joy. As always, you are a treasure. Who are you? What are you doing here? Oh, oh, so because they like bug Pokemon, they're not serious trainers. I happen to like bug Pokemon, so I take offense to that. Level 12. Everybody but gas. Right. I already battled you. There you. No, I am not wearing shorts. I have pants like a normal person. Especially one who is going on an adventure. I mean, you have to deal with tall grass and you've got wild animals and snakes and chokes. I mean, it, it's just... Shorts are not good. You, you have the exposed legs and anything can happen. And you have ice punch. And that does a lot more damage than I expected it to. See if we can... Nope. Disable does not work. And fire spin. Alright. I'm going to try something after we get... There we go. There we go. No! It missed! <clears throat> Excuse me. Can we disable that? You know what? We gotta do it. We got to send Fong to the rescue! And paralyzed. And he's paralyzed. Let's see what a body slam does. Not do much. Okay. Going to wait for that to go down. I'm not going to. There we go. There we go. That's what I wanted to see. I do not want to get hit by that bide. I do not want to lose Fong. Dang, Fong! And Gas gets to level 12. It's exciting stuff. Hopefully in this episode I will make it through Mount Moon, that is the plan, and start my way, well, I'll take on the rival at Cerulean City, battle my way through Nugget Bridge, and I don't want to fight your new Pokemon, I mean, I don't want to fight anybody. Oh, you mean... Okay, with, with my Pokemon. Okay, okay, I got you now. I, I'm with you, I'm with you. Right, Thunder Punch! Thunder Punch comes through! Spiro down! Omastar, another victim for Thunder Punch. Yeah! And there is new grass right down there. Oh, that did not do as much damage as I was hoping it would. It's gonna be a three hitter. Hmm. I don't think that barrier would keep it from knocking it out or killing it and as it is in a nuzlocke. Boom! Gas level 13. Yeah. Do, 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 Done like dinner. Dinner's not done. I actually need to make dinner. It's a little late though. Because I'm going to have to go to bed after this recording, probably. 
Oh man, this is the one that's got. What is it? Level 12, 14. Normally a Jigglypuff. Alright, let's see this. What? No, I just tried to walk by you. What you eat? Did you touch me? Give me this crap. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, it's a Caterpie! It's a Caterpie! Try attack! You better not have anything awesome, Caterpie. Thunder Punch. Okay, okay. You've only got two moves at the moment. Thunder Punch is one. We can handle that. Oh, oh, damn. Okay. Well, I mean, you, you've had a Caterpie, so yeah, that's it. And you... <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. Accuse me of doing something that I did not do. So yeah, that that's how this works. You are not a trainer. You lie, you cannot go that way. Do I have enough money to get my static in? I do! Yes! Normally it wouldn't be a big deal, I know, because it's normally a Magikarp, but these static encounters, hello Nurse Joy, have been randomized, so it will not be a Magikarp. It will be a free level 5. Oh, it's going to be level 5. Okay, it's okay. You know, it, it could still be something awesome, so we will see. Hey, hey, you, give me my Pokemon. It's not a Magikarp, I don't believe you. Woo, a Seedra. We are going to spell your name backwards. Oh, if I can read it backwards and call you Ardaes. Ardaeus. Ar something. What do you got? Seedra's not bad. Thunder Punch and Drill Pack. Alright, alright. I can work with this. Do water types. <coughs> Sorry. Not a bad thing in Nuzlocke. I mean, they are the most common Pokemon in any game, the water types are. And we get a random encounter. Come on, be something awesome. It is a Psyduck. Don't get me wrong. I like Psyduck. But, honestly, I was hoping for something a little bit different. You know, get a little bit of type diversity going. But, you know what? I'll take it. There is definitely worse things to have. Alright, Fong. need you to paralysize this thing. Boom! Psyduck paralysized. We're gonna throw Pokeballs at it. Come on, Duck of the Psy. Woo! Ducky Duck. Psychokinetic powers. We got Psyduck. And we are going to call it. <coughs> or I would, but I don't know how to spell that. So we are going to call you. Oh, I got it. Dim sum the side duck. All right. Wait a minute. At this point, side duck only has one move. So all it has is thrash. That is not good. I do not like that at all. You may be getting deposited for the moment. Whoops, I'm gonna switch you around a little different. It's okay, it is okay. Because I'm getting another encounter in Mount Moon! And I'm excited! Poke. Hello, Nurse Joy! It is me. Mr. Houndrimmer, your favorite customer. 
Even though you don't pay, you know, I don't pay for this. It's just, you know, a free thing. Six Pokeballs! At most six Pokemon. Yes. Store on the PC. Well, I kind of don't have a choice. They automatically get sent there once I have six. Poke. I, I tried poking it. It made me read it. It did not work. Ooh, in the cave. Spooky cave. What's the encounter gonna be? Wait a minute. Maybe I should switch. Just because I might not keep dim sum on the team does. Ooh, got a TM. Does not mean that I want it to die. I still love you, dim sum. It is Peck. Who can learn this? Stu can learn Peck as well. Okay, that's that's something to think about. A pecking sand trip. Ooh, another free item. Water stone. Okay. Ooh, it's a Jolteon. Okay. Um, let's see. What should I do? I mean, none of those are going to take it out, but if it's got an electric. That will be very, very bad. Alright, it's got water gun. Okay, okay. Attack, don't kill, don't kill, don't kill, don't kill. Okay. And bite. Okay, that's that's a little better. Don't kill, don't kill, don't kill, don't kill. Yes! Alright, Fong, you're up. Time to paralysize this thing. And it has rest. Okay, did not see that one coming. That actually complicates things a little bit here. That complicates them a lot, actually. You can't wake up after one turn? What is this sorcery? Ow, quit biting. That's actually starting to hurt. Okay, ball! Ah, come on now. No, stop with the rest. Maybe I should throw a Pokeball while it's asleep. Let's see what happens. Pokeball! Nope, did not work. It was worth a shot. Alright, woke up. Still gonna tackle you. No, stop water gutting stew! That hurts. How do you miss a tackle? Come on now. You d no, no, you do not need to be doing that. Stop that. Oh my goodness. Uh, no, no, I, ca I can't do it. I, I can't do that. I'm pretty sure a body slam will kill, and I really want this Jolteon. That's not a bad move set. And it has Rock Throw. This thing is actually really awesome. And I want it. Come on, let's let's, let's calm down here. Um Okay, we're gonna Thunder Punch! Alright, alright, doing good, doing good. Pokeball! Come on, catch, 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 catch. Dang it, come on now! At least it's quick going for rest. I'm gonna have to disable that if it does it again. Come on now! Come on, Jolteon, quit being a butt! Pokeball, up and beat! Yes! Up and B worked! Lightning Pokemon. Blast 10,000 volts. So we are going to call you, and they did not allow you to put numbers in this. Otherwise, I was going to call it 10,000. I am going to name you.
What are you going to be named? Come on. Let's, let's think of something good here. Jotiandi. Okay, I'm just kind of randomly going around and picking names, but I like it. Doozy. Doozy the Jolteon. Hmm. You're probably going to get... Nope, not Stu. Not Stu. Dim Sum, you're going to get replaced. I'm sorry. It's nothing personal. But it, it's going to happen. But before I do that, let's get some points for our DS. Against this ace trainer with star you. I'm gonna send out some gas against the star you. That'll take out anything. With a bubble beam. Oh, it actually has one of the moves that it can learn. That is odd in an extreme randomized Nuzlocke. Ah, almost got it. Paralyzed. Wow, this is... Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's calm down here. Let's, let's calm down. Our desk to level six. And got a magic card. You know what? Just because that was scary, I'm going to switch out to Noddle. Noddle, 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 Noddle. Take that out. Get out of this cave. I know, I'm awesome. I am in- whoa, I don't want to fight you. Hello, Nurse Joy. I'm back. I wonder if she ever gets tired of healing your Pokemon. I mean, some people come in here a lot. She's like, what are you doing? That you are constantly coming back in all the time. Like, oh, wait, 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 wait. Gotta, gotta, gotta switch out. Nah, Nurse Joy's too nice. And while I'm here, let's go ahead and pause it. Waterstone. Save that for later. Right, you are right there with that. I cannot withdraw a Pokemon because I have Sim. I have some. I have Sim. I have six. Sorry, I had dim sum on the brain. Okay. Doozy. The Jolteon. I gotta get used to these new names. Our Deus is gonna stay up front. Okay, we, we can deal with that. It's alright, it's alright. Don't know why my voice started getting higher, but it did. And it's gonna stay like that for a little bit. Let's take on this girl who is lost right in the entrance. Or maybe she's waiting for her friends who are lost. I blown. I always thought she was lost this close to the entrance, but... Maybe I'm the only one who was thinking that, and she has a level 14, and I did not heal up Doozy. Wow, I'm off my game right now. Muckass Splash. Thank you for that. That is awesome. That is like the best move in the entire game. It is actually not the most useless move in this game, though. Even though it has no effect. Because there is a move as previously discussed in other episodes, that is actually harmful to yourself. Other than something like, you know, self-destruct or explosion. Which I absolutely despise, by the way. Okay. Got a full team of six and even one extra. This Nuzlocke is going pretty good so far. I will knock on wood now. That is my desk. It is made of wood. It is a nice desk.
I always like the music in the caves. But the Viridian Forest one was probably my favorite. Okay, I know he's... There you are, you sneaky, sneaky little thing. Max Revive. Only one of the most useless items in a Nuzlocke. Because you can't revive your Pokemon. When they faint, they dead. Alright. Oh, I forgot you were seven. Hmm. Hitmonchan. Shall face the might of Noddle. And it has Fire Punch. That is bad for Noddle. Noddle the Naughty. Our Mighty. I, I, I meant Mighty. That doesn't sound as good, though. Alright, Doozy, you're up. Doozy, Doozy, Doozy. I feel like Doozy's a girl. Maybe not, but, you know, they didn't have genders in this point, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Oh, no, no, pedal dance. That is not good. That is not good. Oh, thank goodness. Not up for the win again. Alright, confusion. Take that, you driller bee. And Noddle gets to 16. Yeah, Noddle. When are you going to learn a new move, Noddle? I may have to look this up. At some other point. Because this video is rapidly coming to the end, and I am not nearly as far as I wanted to be. Oh, great ball. Sweetness. Alright, what you got? Let's bring it. Go through this cave to get to Cerulean City. Yes, yes, I know. Fun fact for all of you. The towns, I believe all of them in Gen 1, were named after colors. Computers, gray, cerulean, blue. I can't think of any other towns right now for some reason. What is the third one? Ah, this is so bad. Like, Gen 1 is my thing. Gen 1 and... Well, mostly Gen 1. I know quite a bit on Gen 2, but Gen 1 is pretty much my bread and butter. And I cannot think of the third gym. Let's see, Lavender... Saffron, Fuchsia, yes, all colors. Stop earthquaking me! You are a Lapras, you live in the water, how can you do earthquake? This makes no sense. Cinnabar color? I'm guessing it's type of red, probably, because it has the fire badge. Doozy to level 8. And Fong to level 13. Go Fong! and a Jigglypuff. I'm gonna have to exit and heal again after this. Cause I do not want to lose any of my monsters, my pocket monsters. Uh, let's see what you got. Let's go for Rock though that misses and Jigglypuff has Splash. At this point it should have two moves. I normally learn second move at like nine. What is the name of that third town? I have got to remember that. Vermilion! Ah, I feel so much better now. Life is good again. I remember the name. I'm really sure you have more than one move. But if you just want to keep splashing, I am more than happy to deal with that. What do you got? Ah, oh, I was hoping it was another. You know what? You know what? Doozy? Take him out. What you got? You got nothing. Cause, oh, that did not take... Oh, you got, you got Blizzard. No. No, 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 no. I do not want to be dealing with that. I'm pretty sure it would survive. 
The doozy would survive, but I do not want to risk it because I really want to be able to take that one a little bit further. Good move set. It helps me with the type diversity. A hundred? You cheap skates. Give me some real money. I know you guys are loaded. I could have had a Charmeleon. I am sad now. Life is not good anymore. And it has Jump Kick. I'm approaching that mark way faster than I had expected. I apologize, I expected to be a lot further in this game by now. But between the encounters, the trainers... Ooh, it's a doozy! I do not feel like this has been the most productive episode, and for that I apologize. But I do not plan on playing at any time when I am not recording, so you guys will see everything that happens in the episode. You will not miss a thing. Which is good, right? I mean, that way there doesn't have to be any long explanations on what happened because things were messed up or like I didn't turn my mic on, which has happened in some recordings that will never be aired. Ooh, wait, no, yeah, no. Yes, not all, there we go. Rock throw. No, thank you. Confusion? Yes. Oh, we're, we're still doing the rock throw, huh? I told you no already. Quit throwing rocks at me. That is very rude. You can seriously hurt somebody like that. Like, what if it hits me in the eye? Darn kids. So reckless. Nurse Joy! I'm back! I bet she's getting tired of seeing me. Although I may be the only person that doesn't stay here in the Pokemon Center all day. So maybe she loves me because I'm the only different one that she sees. The only one that she actually interacts with. Maybe she hates me. We'll never know. I'm going to go ahead and say she loves me because that's a lot happier note. Alright, you know what? We, we need to start getting through here. I'm going to use my one repel. Yeah! Encounters are down. Unfortunately, this is not a new area, so I will not be catching anything here. I will, however, be battling... A Dratini? Why are you attacking me? I sprayed a repel. You are the same level as the one in my front. In the front of my party. That sounded right. That sounded bad. Ah, la la, I cannot talk. What is going on here? Oh, the gangsters. I don't know, man. Your, your pants look like they're on good, and you got a nice little belt there, so. I don't know. Alright, Fong. You ever wonder why they have those whips? I mean, why do the rocket grunts and all- Whoa, 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 whoa! Slow down! Calm yourself! Cedra, Cedra, you, you need to calm down. You, you need to calm down. We are not having this today. I will not lose a Pokemon on my watch. That is the goal. To never lose a Pokemon. It is not a realistic goal, but it is my goal. And you have a wheezing. You know what? Noddle might just end up having to wipe out this team because I don't know if my guys can handle him. And that mirror move is... Not really doing anything. We're good. We're good. Alright. What else you got? Let's, let's bring it on. Squirtle. Okay. Okay. Can deal with that. Little bee squirtle. Look how cute his little face is. 
I'm gonna punch you with some electricity. And knock you little face go down. And gas gets to 14. And I'm going to grab the item. And awakening. Well, that was a fun trip. Don't know that the item was worth it. The experience was good, but I, I don't know that the item was worth it. Alright, I don't know if you could hear that or not, but that was my timer. So, sadly, this episode is coming to an end. This is episode 3. Like I said, not quite as productive as I was hoping, but... I mean, it, it's progress. So that's going to be it for episode 3, hopefully episode 4, make it through this cave and start with Nugget Bridge, maybe make it through Nugget Bridge, beat the rival, and get close to tackling Misty and her Pokemon. Just, just tackle them to the ground and take that badge. So anyways, thank you all for watching, hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And this is Mr. Houndoomer signing off. Thanks much.